fireplace. Rachel, are you ready? You ready to play some games today? Yeah. yeah. Hey, Mommy's hey, ready to go hey, skiing today too? Come on, Jules, come on. Come here, What's your proposal? If you would like me to drive you to wherever you want, I'll do that. Bring Mommy. the car back and then I'll take a short run today. I don't think I I'm going to ski. Oh, you think there's snow on the thing? On our well, ski a little bit snow? yesterday. Mm -hmm. Mom, I think it's going to snow at the top. Let me know what you think of that. Rachel. Let me do that. What are you going to do short run? What do you mean, Rachel? I'll just go for Rachel. an hour or two up the, uh, the walk to this one. I'll take the bus. The bus runs right in front here. Take it to the other huh. ramp and up Honestly. the gondola. We go well, the first I, day. I can drive everybody down the No, you can't, drive. you can't drive. You can't drive all the kids. Oranges, they are for kids. Orange juice. Mom, I'm working my tea. Good. Not my orange juice. That is a lot more important than the tea. Oh, well, thank you very it's much. Good. Finally got in a movie. Yeah, but that's fine. Finally, finally got in a movie. Yeah. All the guys that shoot the stuff does exist. This and this. And this. That's vitamin C. That's more important than anything else. Than this or anything else. Mm -hmm. You listen to your only. She knows. Because they do. I don't know how much time you record on each dish. Are you happy with your kitchen arrangement? Do you like it? It's pretty nice. Very modern. Modern appliances. Nicely done. Steps down to the living room and kitchen and first floor. We're up in the loft area here. Nice big bedroom. Huge TV set. It must be about 12 or 11 inches. Pocket closet into our bathroom. Volka is saying hello to this morning's journey. High ceiling up there with a nice look out to the window. Out the interesting bowl. Thinking about this for ours. When you do this kind of a wash basin, which is above, you have full utilization of all of the closet space beneath. It's just one little pipe coming through, but doesn't take up half the sink. Nice idea. Likes the pocket doors into our bathroom and into our shower area. Stephanie! Give me one of those rocket boosters up here. Okay, kids. Launch your mortars. Ho! Launch the mortars. Come on, Nathan. Come on, Rachel. Oh. Come on, Nathan. Do it. Go. Do it again. Come on. Wiggle that tooth. Here comes Lammy. Lammy's coming down. One, two, three. Whoa! Where did Rachel go? Did she catch it? I'm in trouble. I'm in big trouble. Here's a new site. Moving a whole rack of skis and boards back to the hotel. I think they're going back to the Fairmont Hotel. Another rack over here. I'm down at the base of the... This is not Whistler. This is Blackcomb. This is the Blackcomb Sky something. Or this Blackcomb Whistler lifts. These lifts actually have a cover that comes over in front and you do a switch up on top. And this is what we did. We did this three of the five days up this way and two out of Whistler. Here's where they do this uh, Chateau Whistler wreck. People just wreck them up and away they go. That's the Fairmont Hotel over there. I'll do a close up of the, of the other uh, swim area. Well, here's the scene. This is the base of the Blackcomb area. Whistler's a little bit further to the south here. I'll just walk and scan this so you can get a feeling of the, the ski area of Canada. 
lovely, lovely operation they've got here. This is Olympics 2010, Winter Olympics. And there's the black comb sign going up to the mountain. Guy skiing right by me here to the wrecks. There's the wrecks. You get a sense of the visibility here. I fell more times in the last five days than I did in probably five years of skiing. Visibility up on these lifts is zero. You can't see a thing coming down half the time. Lots of fog and then it snowed and very few seconds of sun. Activity here at the end of the day too. There's the Whistler Kids section. A lot of outdoor restaurants. This is Merlin's Fire and Grill. People eating out here in this, uh, it's about one degree, I'd say, one degree centigrade, maybe 33 Fahrenheit. This is, we are in the upper village here. This is the Whistler Village. And this is the, the section we're in right here. Here's the Fairmount, and that's the path that we take over to our hotel. The upper village. And here I'm just shooting from uh, this section. I'll do a 360 here. There's a road that's Blackcomb Way, I think. That's the sign I just shot. I'll just do 360 around. Lots of lighting. Lights are coming on now. 3:40 p.m. People still coming down. I think the lifts are stopped going up. They're going coming down with downloading, as they call it. This is the Fairmont Hotel. Polka and Steffi had lunch in the Portobello Lounge there today. And let me zoom in on something about the games. Does that say porn for the games or born for the games? 2010. It's quarter to four, yep. Okay, let's zoom back. And this will be the last scene of this area. I'm going back to our hotel. The Fairmount Chateau Whistler to the right. Little plaza area here. Hi. I'm going to zoom in in a minute in the steam bats that you see the steam rising. It's the Fairmount Hotel. And this steam area here. There's the Portobello Volca, and Steffi had their lunch retreat there. And this Fairmont is where Folka wants to go. And if you can see this here, there's people, this is outdoors, little glass window, taking a jacuzzi bath, all kinds of uh, bathrobes and stuff available to keep you warm. Triangle view of this jacuzzis. Ladies coming out. A lot of steam there. This is all year round I think they just run these jacuzzis. This is the Fairmount Hotel. I'm going to scan this whole thing. Here is the um, crow weather vane that they have set up outside about four or five little parks in this area and here is a s something coming down the hill here a little ski Hello. run what are you doing? I'm shooting movies well, and these are, are the mountains up here lots of clouds look at all those clouds hanging visibility is just about zero up there I don't think I want to be skiing down that today and that's the end of this odyssey, ladies and gentlemen. New Year's Eve tonight. It's our home for the last six nights. $4,000. Six nights. Sort of a two-bedroom and a closet. And right above the lobby area, in this triangle, behind that is the jacuzzi.
You can see some people walking in the jacuzzi area there. Maybe, maybe Winslow's in there right now. And just to the left of the entrance is the 